Hello. This game, Nothing But Net, involves projectile motion. Now for new teams, this might this might not make very much sense, so I'm going to explain it to you in physics terms. A projectile motion is when the ball is launched, and this can be broken up into two components. Um, your horizontal velocity and your vertical velocity, and this is taken from your initial velocity and angle. Ta taking your trig functions, you can plug them into your kinematics equations to find your ideal angle. You plug them into the vertical components because gravity is at a constant speed of 9.8 meters per second or 32.2 feet per second, which the time between the vertical components is the exact same thing as the horizontal components, so you can find your ideal angle through there. ideal angle is 45 degrees. However, this is not always true because that's not taking account for friction or air resistance. Now it's possible to find the speed that it takes to require to shoot the full distance of our 12 by 12 arena. First you need to set up a time equation that you can plug in later and a range equation that you need to plug in later. Again, taking the kinematics equations, it is possible to find the speed that you need to be able to shoot your flywheel at in order to reach full court. For the delta y, I'm plugging in two feet because that's about where the net is. And then the other equations I'm plugging in that I got from the time earlier. From here, it's required to use a calculator in order to figure out the numbers. We find out it's going to take about 21.62 feet per second or 6.7 meters per second in order to be able to shoot full court. Now, this isn't exactly precise because this is again not taking in air resistance or the friction that you're going to have on your own flywheel. Hopefully this helps you guys with your own flywheels. Happy roboting!